Hello, everyone. Hello, guests and family. Can you hear me through this? Okay, that's better. So we are here to induct uh, this class of really great inventors into the academy and to join us. Um, each of you have done amazing things to get to this point. It is not easy to become a fellow in this academy. And, and uh, so congratulations. I would also like to tell you a couple things. One is there's a block that's outlined on that carpet for the guests. And please use that for taking any pictures so we don't block some other things. We've had some rules in here relating to uh, exits and things like this, so we have the metals over behind that door. It's going to make it a little more difficult for us, but if you can do that, that'd be great. Um, as well, I wanted to introduce another video, and that is a video by uh, Undersecretary Kathy Vidal, who was sworn in as, as the Undersecretary and Director of the USPTO on April 13th. She's a software engineer, design engineer by training. She has a long and distinguished career as a patent attorney in California. Uh, and as a, the newly sworn in director of the patent office, she has many demands on her time and was not able to join us this evening and has recorded a video for us that we'd like to play for you. Normally we have, um, we, if she was here, we wouldn't be playing video and she would be helping with the medals. And, uh, but this time, because of her demands, uh, we have another USPTO person that I'll be telling you about to give us the medals, who's fantastic, and you know her. All right, so let's watch the video. Kathy Vidal. Hello, and a warm welcome to all. Thank you, Dr. Sandberg, for your leadership as president of the National Academy of Inventors and for your vision in creating the NAI 12 years ago. Under your stewardship, the NAI has grown into being one of our nation's premier inventor recognition organizations, highlighting inventors and inventions and their role in academia and society was so important when NAI was created. Now, it is essential. At a time when we need to foster new technologies and commerce to address major global challenges, the efforts of our inventors and entrepreneurs are needed now more than ever before. At a time when we need to create jobs, foster economic prosperity, and provide access to the innovation ecosystem for all Americans, your work is essential. And of course, thank you to all the great and hardworking people who made today's event a reality. In my short time as director, it has been about a month now, I have already noted the outstanding work that the National Academy of Inventors does to support the USPTO and our nation. NAI has played a pivotal role in increasing public awareness on the importance of an open, robust, and reliable intellectual property ecosystem. Academic innovation and the many IP specialists who support it through the tech transfer organizations at your institutions is vital to the success of our country. With more than 250 academic institutions and over 4,000 individuals, we know that the NAI is one of the most important catalysts for innovation. NAI fellows have generated more than 13,000 licensed technologies. You collectively hold more than 48,000 patents. You have created over 1 million jobs and have generated over 3 trillion in economic output through your inventions. I also love that diversity and inclusion have been a major theme of this year's conference and the major component of the USPTO's joint project agreement with NAI. We need all hands on deck and to unleash the power of every American. I am very excited about our joint effort to pool resources to broaden diversity, equity, and inclusive access to the innovation ecosystem. Though we are especially targeting historically underserved communities, 
minorities, women, veterans, and persons with disabilities, we want to be here for everyone. In support of our joint effort, NAI has been conducting fo focus groups at this year's conference. We look forward to the results of those discussions and other outreach sessions the Academy will be hosting in the coming months. Now, let's turn to this year's inductees. To this year's inductees, to the National Academy of Inventors, and on behalf of the 13,500 employees of the U.S. Patent and Trademark Office, congratulations and thank you. I thank you on behalf of the PTO, on behalf of Secretary Raimondo, and on behalf of President Biden, and personally, your intellectual property and the knowledge that it creates and is shared is our country's most valuable asset. Your creativity, determination, and your inventions are essential to the livelihood and advancement of millions of people in our country. And to our inductees families, thank you. Thank you for supporting your inventor. We all know that sacrifices are required to pursue research and development, commercialize inventions, and most importantly, to take the time to mentor and guide students and our next generation of creators. Thank you for being there for all of us. To this year's class of fellows, you are extraordinary. You hail from 116 research universities and government and nonprofit profit research institutes worldwide. And collectively, you hold over 4,800 U.S. issued patents. Let me repeat that, 4,800 U.S. patents. That's truly remarkable. You have kept many of our patent examiners and probably a like number of patent attorneys very busy. Thank you to all of them as well who joined you on your journey. Your research and entrepreneurship cover a broad range of scientific disciplines and the transfer of your technologies from out of the lab and into the market has brought your innovations to impact. I am also very pleased that your class reflects NAI's commitment to diversity and inclusion in its own membership. 52 of you are ethnic minorities and 27 of you are women, including three outstanding academic female African-American inventors. To all of you, you know your accomplishments are the fruits of dedicated work, of not giving up in the face of diversity and adversity. You are leaving an indelible mark on our society and country, and your greatest legacy will be the future generation of inventors you nurture and inspire every day at your universities. You are the true heroes of our country. I look forward to your continued advocacy of innovation throughout every aspect of American society. And I hope you share your stories early and often. Your stories are what inspire and empower all of us. I also hope I will have the opportunity to welcome you in person next year when the Academy holds its annual conference in Washington, DC. We look forward to hosting your visit to the USPTO's beautiful campus in Alexandria, Virginia, and having you meet the amazing people who work at America's innovation agency, the USPTO, to help you bring your dreams to reality. Thank you. Wonderful video. Uh, she's gonna be a great, great uh, director and undersecretary. Is it on? There, it, I'm sorry. Did you hear me already on that? Okay. All right, so she has empowered the regional director, Elizabeth Doherty, with giving the medals this year. And you all know her, and Elizabeth also, of course, acted as our MC. She's terrific, she's fantastic. So, uh, and, I, and she's been on our board, you know, the, the PTO has two positions on our board, and, and she's been one of them for many years. So, come on up. Good. Thank you. Okay, so how this is going to work, you've already heard. Um, 
we are going to, the first, what I can warn you in is, I don't know which way you're going, but the first few of you, probably there because I see an A, the first few of you, um, it will, it'll be a little, until we get into the groove, uh, you might experience differences. Katerina Akashuglu, University of California, San Francisco. Jude Sion An, University of Texas Health Science Center at Houston. Andrea Armani, University of Southern California. Santok Adesha, Purdue University. Sanjay Banerjee, the University of Texas at Austin. Madan Bassin. Louisiana State University. Ronald Bidegger, Texas Heart Institute.
Robert Bowser, Barrow Neurological Institute. Robert ba Marcel Bruches, Carnegie Mellon University. Bryce Chikarian, the University of New Mexico. Babu Shalamala Sandia National Laboratories. Joe Chappelle, University of Kentucky. Shigao Chen, Mayo Clinic. Ying Ying Chen, Rutgers, the State University of New Jersey. Shi Cheng Yen, Su Tai University of Science and Technology. Accepting the award today is Deborah Boudreaux, CEO of Buddhist Su Tai Foundation. Keith M. Chug. University of Southern California. TC Mike Chung, the Pennsylvania State University.
William Clark, University of Pittsburgh. Jingshen Jason Tong, University of California, Los Angeles. Stuart Cooper, The Ohio State University. Gerard Cote, Texas A&M University. Douglas Covey, Washington University in St. Louis. Gregory Crawford, Miami University. Ronald Crystal, Weill Cornell Medicine. Fa Foster Dye, Auburn University. Ted Dawson, Johns Hopkins University. Alina L. Dawson, Johns Hopkins University. Anant. Dada Balaper, the University of Texas at Austin. Mutaz El No Zahai. King Abdullah University of Science and Technology.
Thomas H. Epps III, University of Delaware. Wrong fan, Yale University. Lizelle Folks, the University of Arizona. Francis Stewart Foster, University of Toronto. Holly Frost, Jr., the University of Texas at Arlington. Bruce Gale, the University of Utah. Bruce Gates, University of California, Davis. Martin Gleave, the University of British Columbia. Jordan Green, Johns Hopkins University. Robert Goldberg, University of Oregon. Robert P. Hammer, Louisiana State University. Benjamin Harvey. Naval Air Warfare Center, Weapons Division, China Lake. Mm -hmm. 
Ayanna Howard, The Ohio State University. James Hubbard, Jr., Texas A&M University. Lawrence Hurley, the University of Arizona. Alex Ignatsev, University of Houston. David Jaffray. University of Texas MD Anderson Cancer Center. Wilfred A. Jeffries, the University of British Columbia. Harry Calva, Florida Atlantic University. Richard B. Kaner, University of California, Los Angeles. Anumantha Kanthasami, University of Georgia. Sanjeev Kapoor. Illinois Institute of Technology. Frederick A. Kish Jr., North Carolina State University.
Chongchia J. Kua, University of Southern California. Sydney Edward Law, University of Georgia. Kelvin Lee, University of Delaware. Zinjin Lei, Cornell University. Henry Lester, California Institute of Technology. Chenzong Li, Tulane University. King Lee, University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign. Xiao Cheng Lee, University of California, Los Angeles. Jean Ming Leong, Arizona State University. Z. K. Leon, University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign. Richard Leon, Florida State University. Ming Lin, University of Maryland College Park.
Stephen R. Little, University of Pittsburgh. Zeng Rong Lu, Chase Western Reserve University. Thomas Mackey, University of Wisconsin, Madison. AJ Malshi, Purdue University. Terry Matsunaga, the University of Arizona. Craig Meyer, University of Virginia. Alan Michaels, Virginia Polytechnic Institute and State University. Osama Mohammed, Florida International University. Subra Mohapatra, University of South Florida. Daniel William Moran, Washington University in St. Louis. Morton Mower, University of Colorado, Denver. His family will be accepting in his memory today.
John P. Mugler III, University of Virginia. Russell John Mumper, the University of Alabama. Govindarajan Mor Olita, Oak Ridge National Laboratory. Priyabrata Mukherjee, the University of Oklahoma Health Sciences Center. D. Scott Niesman, University of Georgia. Tina Ng, University of California, San Diego. Vincent Nijar, University of Maryland, Baltimore. Anson Ung, the University of Texas at San Antonio. Abraham Uman, University of Nebraska Lincoln. Miri Ozkan, University of California, Riverside. Karen Panetta, Tufts University.
David S. Peabody, the University of New Mexico. Research Laboratory. Rosalind Picard, Massachusetts Institute of Technology. Samuel Preen, Texas Tech University and Texas Tech University Health Science Center. Clive Randall, the Pennsylvania State University. Renigula Bashu Shavesha Rao, the Catholic University of America. Shubrata Roy, University of Florida. Beyond Charla Olu, University of Wisconsin-Madison. Majid Saraf Sardeh. University of California, Los Angeles. Richard A. Schatz, Duke University. Chandan Sen, Indiana University.
Cyrus Shahabi, University of Southern California. Andre Scheichel, University of California, Irvine. Susan Sokolowski, University of Oregon. Louis Sun, University of Connecticut. Earl Schwarzlander, Jr., the University of Texas at Austin. Jumming Tang, Washington State University. Unish Takor, University of Houston. Mark Van Dyke, the University of Arizona. George Vargis. University of California, Los Angeles. Benke Venkatesan, the University of Oklahoma. Bing Wong, Georgia State University.
Linda Wang, Purdue University. Sean Wang, Stanford University. Anthony Weiss, the University of Sydney. Gregory Welch, University of Central Florida. David Witten the University of New Mexico. Neil Woodbury. Arizona State University. Darren Woodside, Texas Heart Institute. Jenny Yang, Georgia State University. Habib Zagwali. University of Missouri, Columbia. Liang Fang Zhong. University of California, San Diego. Mingming Jiao, Mount Sinai Health System.
Well, this is an amazing, amazing group. And congratulations, congratulations all. Uh, the, the diverse universities that everyone's in, it just shows the, the development and the, in, the innovation we have all this, this world and the, and the country.